There are five very specific reasons why you should start a social media marketing agency right now and why this may just be your last chance. The first reason why you should probably start your social media marketing agency right now is the growing demand. Especially if you look at the growth of the e-commerce landscape, which has grown more in the past 12 months than in the past 10 years. Also, if you look at Shopify, which is the platform that most brands host their store in, it's grown 50% year on year for the past five years. And so I often get a lot of questions from people asking me if social media marketing agency is still doable, if it's too late. And honestly, I always laugh because I think of the millions of e-com stores out there compared to maybe be the thousands of e-com agencies, if that, probably more like 500 to 1,000 e-com stores, they're actually doing things, not just talking on Facebook communities and networking with people online and you know talking about how they're going to start their e-com agency, but actually doing things and providing value to the market. And it becomes very apparent why there's so much opportunity in the space. I mean, first of all, you've got a ton of new businesses being opened up every single day who want to gain an edge from the very get-go. They understand that to really have success in 2022 and 2023 with your brand, with your brand online, you need to get eyeballs predictably on your products, on your brand. And they understand that the most predictable, efficient, and profitable way of doing so is through paid advertising, is through digital marketing. In fact, a lot of these founders who are starting these new businesses, they not only see digital marketing as an opportunity, but they now see it as a necessity to actually compete in today's marketplace. But you've also got those existing businesses who've just been cruising along, and now they're realizing that they need to get digital marketing on board if they are to compete and have true longevity. And they have a lot of FOMO fear of missing out because they're seeing all these incredible billion dollar brands being built on the back of digital marketing, like Gymshark, Kylie Cosmetics, or Drunk Elephant. They urgently need a digital marketing agency to come in and solve this for them as soon as possible. And finally, you've also got those current businesses who've been running paid advertising for maybe a while now, but they're looking to take things to a whole new level. In fact, I've actually come to realize that the easiest sales are those businesses that are actively doing the service that I'm offering, that are actively running Facebook ads. And there's two very simple reasons for that. Number one, it means that they already see value in it because they're actively investing into it, right? So you don't have to convince them of the service. And number two, if they're not doing well, they're actively losing money. So they're gonna be more motivated to change stuff up so they can stop losing money and start making money than someone who just sees it as a cool thing that they could do and you know, and wouldn't it be great to get paid ads on board? And I'm telling you from experience that these are the businesses that we mostly sign. And so do not think for a second that just because they're running ads already, which is the minority of brands anyways, that they're not in the market for a marketing agency. There's also those brands who have maybe crushed it with Facebook ads, but they're looking to add another traffic source to take things to a whole new level. Maybe they've, as I said, crushed it with Facebook ads, but now they're looking to add TikTok ads or Snapchat ads or Pinterest ads to their marketing mix. Growing demand, that is the first reason why you should start a social media marketing agency right now before 2023. And the second reason is all about longevity. When it comes to being a great salesperson, you need to understand your prospect at a very intimate level. You need to understand what keeps them up at night, what their strongest pain points are, and what their deepest desires are. Once you do this, you will realize that getting customers predictably through the door for any business owner is the most valuable skill out there. And at the same time, not having a predictable stream of customers, not knowing where their next customer is gonna come from, is by far the most painful thing for any business owner. It's the number one thing that keeps them up at night. They just dream of having a predictable stream of highly qualified customers through the door pretty much on autopilot. And so my point here is that businesses will always need marketing agencies to come in and solve this big issue for them. The need for marketing agencies is going absolutely nowhere. And it is by far the best option out there when you compare it to their alternatives like uh, you know, hiring a freelancer or hiring an employee. For example, an employee needs training, whereas a marketing agency is super agile because they've worked on a myriad of different projects, they've solved a bunch of different problems, they've pretty much seen it all in an industry, and chances are they can solve the business owner's problem. They don't need insurance, they don't need compensation if you fire them, they don't take up office space, and the list goes on. And you add the fact that this is the biggest issue that business owners face, to the fact that already, but even more in the next three to five years, everyone, I'm talking everyone and their mother is going to be selling something online, whether it's a service, a product or information. And this has been just accelerated by what has happened in the past three years. And so the people that establish themselves as the go-to person, as the rainmakers who can sell anything online are going to be the most valuable people, are going to be the most sought out after people in the marketplace. Now, this does not mean that you should just delay or procrastinate on jumping onto the space because I know what a bunch of you are thinking, oh, you know, I'll, I'll do it eventually, right? I'll get into the space eventually. Oh, that sounds like a cool idea. Three to five years, I still got time. That's just simply not the case because as I said, the people that have asserted themselves over the years as the go-to person, they will be seen as the raymakers and they will be the most in-demand people in the market. So the marketing agencies that get in now and start building that momentum, start building that clientele, they're going to be 
reap so many benefits going forward and establishing themselves as an authority in the digital marketing space. Because the agency game is a lot about referrals, building authority, who you've worked with in the past. And this does not mean that you cannot get clients without having worked with anyone in the past, because I got my first client without having worked with anyone. And so does everyone. But the sooner you can get past that first hurdle, the sooner you can start building your clientele, building your reputation, building your referral system, really just tapping into this flywheel effect that makes the agency game so much fun when you've been in the game for six months, 12 months, even two years. Because quite frankly, when the three to five year mark hits and everyone is selling something online, I truly believe that we're really gonna have a scenario where there's not gonna be much of a middle class. The rich are gonna get richer, meaning the people that are really established, really at the top, they're gonna get a lot of demand. They're gonna get a lot of clients coming their way and the poor are only gonna get poorer, meaning that the people at the bottom, they're not gonna get that many deals because the market has been established. However, for now, if you look at the market, it's not a very mature market. We're still in the very early stages, which means newcomers can come in and have a lot of opportunities come their way. The third reason, and this one was massive for me to make the decision to finally start my agency, is transferable skills. What I mean by this is that building an agency is not like doing crypto or doing stocks where it's very one dimensional. You learn one skill and that's pretty much it, right? When you build an agency, your development as a business person is very holistic. You learn about building a team, sales, branding, marketing, outreach, out copy, media buying, and the list goes on. You learn as you go, but it is mind boggling the number of high income skills you garner during the whole journey. And the great thing about this is that I'm probably not gonna be running my agency for 50 plus years. I may, right? But when when you decide to make that jump and start another passion project on the side, maybe you keep your agency as a cash flow a business that funds your passion project. You can take a lot of the skills that you've garnered throughout the whole journey and apply them to your next venture. Essentially, all the stuff that you're learning doesn't just go to waste, right? You just transfer it and it helps you build another thing, helps you add more value to the marketplace, helps you build more wealth for yourself, and it helps you just become a badass, well-rounded entrepreneur. And look, I know what some of you may be thinking, oh, you know, I don't, I don't know all these skills. Like, do I have to learn all these skills before I start? Um, you know, I, I don't think I can start now. I need to learn all this stuff. I'm going to pick up all the books on these different topics. Do not do that. That is knowledge paralysis. You want to take imperfect action. You want to learn as you go. Do not have that prevent you from just getting started. Because quite frankly, I didn't know much about any of these skills when I started and I've come to become pretty good at them during the whole journey. The next reason why you should start a social media marketing agency right now is because quite frankly, it is the fastest way to six figures. I made a video on this topic a lot more in depth and I'll leave it here just a few days ago. And in that video, I talk about why it's much easier than you think to scale to 10 per month to six figures with an agency. And this is a big reason simply because I truly believe, and this is backed by data, there are studies that show this, that from like, I think zero to 75K uh, a year, that is the biggest, most drastic uh, shift when it comes to happiness and when it comes to like lifestyle change. And then anything above, there's just like little increments um, in happiness and, and just lifestyle change. But I truly believe that at six figures, your life changes drastically. It did for me. Uh, I was finally able to take care of myself, my loved ones, travel the world, have an incredible apartment, and the list goes on. And the agency uh, model lends itself very well to getting you to six figures because we can charge high ticket. A client to us is worth anywhere between, you know, two to 5K per month minimum. We have very high profit margins, so we don't need to get to like 30, 50K per month to take home 10K. Like if we make 11K per month, we're probably taking home 10K per month. That's how the game works. And so you really only need three to five clients to already be at 10K per month, which means you only really need to sell and convince three to five people to already be at six figures, which is life changing. So that's pretty cool. And the final reason is connections. Look, when I started in the entrepreneurial game, I used to hear the saying that went, your network is your net worth. And I always thought that was absolutely bullshit um, until I realized that it really isn't, right? I don't think your first business is a game of like who you know. I truly believe that you can be widely successful with an agency without knowing anyone and without having any network. I didn't, certainly, right? But it gets to a point in your life where the people that you do know make a major difference. And so, no, you don't need a lot of connections. No, you don't need a big network to start your first business, to start your agency. But as you start making a name for yourself, as you start becoming a person of value that people want to be around, that people want to have a conversation with, right? You start garnering a plethora of incredible connections that really just help you out in life. And that has been the case for me. In sales calls, I used to sit across founders and I would tell them, like, I I've used your product. And funnily enough, 
I think that helped me in those sales calls. And a lot of those founders that I signed actually went on to become good friends of mine. Not only did I learn a lot from them just about general entrepreneurship, but also about different aspects of building a business, not just the marketing, but customer service, you know, team culture, branding, product development, logistics. But they often became valuable connections when it came to building my own econ brand and taking a lot of the capital, the team, all these skills that, I, that I'd garnered during the journey to start that brand. In fact, one of the businesses that I signed for my agency, that brand became my highest equity deal. And then the founders of that brand helped me with the logistics and the product development of my own econ brand, which is pretty cool. And that's really one of the great reasons why I would urge anyone to start a social media marketing agency because you're talking to people, you're making incredible connections. And look, I'm not the biggest extrovert, right? I'm, I'd probably say I'm like in between introverted, extroverted, but there's absolutely no denying that talking to people, making connections, building a team, it's just much more fulfilling than doing a little side hustle on your computer uh, for eight to 10 hours a day, not talking to anyone, just looking at a bunch of numbers on a screen. And those, my friend, are the five reasons why you should finally start a social media marketing agency if you haven't already and get the ball rolling. Because look, without going on a tangent, I'm a true believer that when you set your mind to something, your mind, your infinite intelligence, call it whatever you want, just finds a way to get it done. It just finds the resources to get you there. If you're constantly putting limits on your mind, looking for excuses why it's not the right time, why it's too saturated, why this might not be for me, then yeah, 100%, you're probably never gonna get results with your social media marketing agency. But if you've watched this video until this point, which I appreciate you for it, and you're looking into this, chances are you're considering it. And I truly believe, and I urge you to take the initiative, take the step forward and get in the fun. Potentially, eventually go head to head against me. But my point is, stop watching from the sidelines, stop considering whether you should do it and just take action, be decisive and get right into it. And with that being said, hopefully you enjoyed this video. If you wanna watch more free trainings on how to build your social media marketing agency, literally my best secrets and tips, I'm going live pretty much daily on my free Facebook mastermind, completely for free. If you want to be a part of that, there's going to be a link in the description. All you have to do is just go ahead, click apply, fill out a bunch of questions. If you're a good fit, we'll let you in and I will see you on the next video. Peace.